Okay, uh, this is a drop off. Um, someone on YouTube knows me and they know somebody who knows me. So, what they told this person that knows me is hey, um, sell everything here for this price. And I went up paying $125 for everything. And they said, then I would like them to make a video uh, about it, which I'm going to do. Um, so, anyway. Included in this lot that I paid $125 for is uh, what you're going to see. I got a Wii. Uh, supposedly things work, but uh, you know how it is. I like to test myself. Controllers. So I'm actually going to... That's the rest of the Wii. I'm actually going to go home and try everything and make sure it's all good. Um, this looks like a case for a DS. Um, there were some books. Normally I don't buy books, so these I'm actually going to give to my friends. So I'm glad I'm... I was going to do the pickup video before I got here anyway. Uh, Pokemon Perfect Guide. A uh, Star Wars book, another Pokemon Go version. Yeah, I don't take these. You, um, it is a good game, but I don't sell these with these binders because they take up space. They get ruined and stuff. So I give them to my friend, and he just puts them on online and sells them. That's a European magazine. Which one? It's Prima. Oh well, Prima you see all over the place. Prima is not unusual to find. Uh, a official guide for Pokemon Advance. Uh, a Zapper catalog, which I'm just going to give to my friend, and a Pokemon Crystal version. Uh, I got an Assassin's Creed 3. Uh, another. Oh, that's, oh no, that's not bundled together. This looks like an aftermarket uh, charger. And this looks like it would work for a. Uh, PS1, it looks like. No, this would be a Sega. Oh, yeah, maybe a yeah. PS1. But I would, I would think Sega, like yeah, uh, Sega number two. There's a controller. I have a, I have someone just hanging with it. This looks like it's part of a Sega Saturn, right? Uh, it looks like a, a battery pack for this one. Oh, there you go. Um, supposedly this works. Uh, it, it's coming with a Sonic the Hedgehog game. These aren't easy to sell. Um, one of the problems that you get with these, well, if it works, yeah. I'll sell it to you. Um, one of the problems you get with these is you get uh, lines. Uh, it, the video usually goes, or it's a sound issue. It's the, the what you call it, the things. Can in you the, fix it if it's not working right? I think I know a guy. His okay, name's okay. Mo. He he works in town. He probably. Hey, Mo will fix it for you. Sonic the Hedgehog. So okay. so I'm gonna leave this here, and you believe that this goes with this? Yeah, it looks okay. like a, a battery pack. Uh, this is some kind of camera. It's a webcam. Oh, uh, webcam. Uh, just a goofy like stuff. PS3. Uh, would it work for PSA? Okay, that's cool. Uh, this looks, uh, you know, let me get to the Sega Center. Then I, there's actually a group of, like, no big deal, not very valuable games. Like, here's an anticipation. I'm going to take this and give it to my friends. I'm going to give them the sleeves, I think. Uh, believe it or not, you can sell sleeves online for a buck a piece. Anticipation. Uh, what's this? That, there's not going to be any good games here, I know that. Uh, volleyball. There's Modern Warfare. Um, looks like, uh, well, this is actually a pretty good game. This I can probably sell for like ten dollars loose. Hey, look at this. It's uh, a limited edition. One of these things. All right. Well, Modern uh, Warfare Two limited edition. What is this? Like a ten dollar game, maybe or uh, ten dollars now. Ten dollars. So, yeah. That's just uh, nothing here is is uh, like uber valuable. So it's over time that I'll, here's a R.I.B. baseball. I don't sell these games very well. Um, and and then here's a. Track and fields. These have almost no value. If anybody, this is more of the Wii. Yeah. Uh, that's the cable. So that's more of the Wii. The Wii's I can only sell for like maybe forty bucks. They're they're not even easy to sell, either. Um, then I did get some Game Gear games. Here's Revenge of Dragon Con. Not familiar with that. I haven't gotten any Game Boy games in a while. This is another Jordan. Uh, this is a Sega Genesis game. I don't sell them at the flea markets in the cases. I'm just going to give this straight to my friend. Um, these Sega Game Gear cases, uh, Chase HQ. That's a, that's a good so -so game. Here's a Sonic. It looks like Sonic Spinball. Yep, it is. Yeah, Sonic Spinball. Uh, this is a Donald Duck. Probably a fun game. Uh, I don't think... I Sega games are just not... Uh, they don't have any value. Clutch Hitter. Um, I mean, if I check, maybe I'd be surprised. Yeah, there's, on one a, couple, or two. there's a couple rare. Slider. Ones. Never heard of it. Maybe it's a nice one. Uh, columns, very That's common game. Uh, there's like, like a billion of them. Yeah. Um, here is a Sega Genesis controller. It looks nice and clean. Uh, and it looks like under the Saturn, which this is the first, this is actually probably the second Saturn I've had in my lifetime. I just do not yeah. find these. Um, here's a Sega Genesis, uh, and uh, so I guess that's part of that. Uh, and here's another controller. Looks kind of nice and clean. 
and then here's another controller and this also looks nice and clean and this is probably for uh, either the Sega Saturn or this the is Sega Saturn uh, Genesis okay so this would be for the Genesis I don't even use these um, because I went online and I bought uh, um, uh, adapters, AVs that will work with new TV. So yeah. this to me, eh, I'm just going to give it to my friend probably. Uh, and this must be the power supply. Yes, this is the power supply for the one. To be honest, I don't even use these. I use aftermarket ones because sometimes you can sell these for more on uh, yeah. eBay or Amazon. So I, I've been providing the aftermarket. The aftermarket ones, if I buy about 30 of them, I get, uh, here's some more papers. This is a poster. Look. Oh, okay. You I know, have I got a. Oh, that's cool. It's nice. Okay, well, my friend will like that. Uh, I'm not going to do anything with it. I don't have poster space. I like to hang art on my walls. <laughs> so, um, all right, here we go. I'll go through these games. Here's a uh, Haunted Mansion and uh, Harry Mine. Potter. These games have very little value. Minecraft book. Um, I don't know if this has any value. I'll probably it just really give that doesn't. to my friend. Yeah, I don't think so. I don't think so. All right, um, then I actually don't even know if I checked all these or condition, but again, they said they were working, so I went quickly. Uh, Star Wars 2, this probably has zero value. MC Groove Dance Craze. Don't even. Collectible, maybe. Uh, Sega C2 2002. Find the right guy, it's uh, Zero value, zero value. Uh, probably worth a few dollars. Yeah. Zero value unsellable, zero value unsellable. Um, Probably this may, what maybe five or eight or something. It's not um, a good game. Yeah, but people that like Sims, you know, <laughs> Wipeout. This probably has very little value. Uh, Car is probably like a four dollar game. Um, this probably has no resale value. This is probably a three or four dollar game. Uh, this has probably zero value. And somebody, if they did buy it, would be to play it and make fun of it yeah. online. Uh, another Madden. There's about a million of these. Uh, Curious George. No real value, um, as far as I know. Am I wrong on that? It's probably worth three or four dollars. Curious George fans. Yeah. <laughs> I have to hope they have the GameCube or the Wii though. Uh, 007 Quantum of Silence. Probably like a five dollar or four dollar game. Lair. Not sure. Not very value. Ice Age Two. Uh, very little value. Maybe I could uh, lock them together and put them on eBay. Mm. This is probably like a $10 game or something. Yeah. yeah. And this is probably a 3 or $4 game. And then, uh, oh, here's another. Did I get a power supply for that Sega set or does it take a uh, regular plug? I, on. Okay, oh, this yeah. is a very common plug. I have a ton of these. That's not a problem at all. Um, this must be the, uh, the controller. Uh, again, I would probably go online. Uh, you know, I might sell it like this. Um, I, I, I don't even think I have any Sega Saturn game. Let me open it and see if there's there is not a game in the. To I be guess, honest, I, I don't know what I'm going to do um, with this. Your so. friends over there, they have their same four games for it. So maybe I'll buy one of those later, and then that's it. So that's that's another lot of things I got. I'm going to do this video separately. 125. It's okay. You know, it's a yeah. decent amount of just regular stuff that I will sell over a very long and extended period of time. Yeah.